Hi, I'm Dr. Tarone Lodog, physician, teacher, and author of National Geographic's Life is Your Best Medicine. Come and join me on a journey towards healing, health, and wholeness. You know, you can't turn on the news today without hearing about omega-3 fatty acids, and I'm a fan. I take omega-3 fatty acids, and I eat fish in my diet every week. Now, some of the concerns that people have about eating fish are that they can be high in mercury. Well, that is a concern, but remember you want to stay away from the large predatory fish, things like shark, king mackerel, tilefish. Large fish that eat small fish accumulate mercury as it moves up the food chain. So don't forget sardines and anchovies can be a good source of omega-3s. And of course, one of my favorite, this is wild Alaskan king salmon. And, and this is very high in omega-3s and also low in mercury and it's sustainable. Three things that are all very important to me. If you want to find out which fish are sustainable, which ones are high in omega-3s and low in mercury, go to National Geographic's Sustainable Seafood website and you can get all the information that you need. Remember that you can also get omega-3s from plants. Flaxseed and chia are rich sources. I like walnuts. They're easy to add to the diet. Only a small handful, a couple tablespoons a day, give you a rich source of plant-based omega-3s that can help balance out uh, perhaps when you're not getting enough fish. Last but not least, omega-3s are so important that if you're not eating fish on a regular basis, you may want to consider getting fish oil supplements. They come available for adults and you can see that they even put them in yummy forms for children. Now, adults need between 6 and 800 milligrams of EPA and 3 to 500 milligrams of DHA. Children need mostly DHA up until the age of about 5. According to the Institute of Medicine, all of us, starting at age one, need approximately 1,200 milligrams of omega-3 fatty acids in our diet every day. This is important for our brain health. It's very important for our eye health. It may help protect us against depression. It's an adjunctive treatment in people who have bipolar. It's certainly important for our heart health. We know that eating fish is a recommendation by the American Heart Association because all of these things that the omega-3 fatty acids bring to our life are good for us. Omega-3 fatty acids are vitally important for your health, so I hope that you will add them to your everyday life. Because remember, life, it's your best medicine.